I arrived here like one month ago now for the Palestine and Israel in Context internship. I had the opportunity to learn Arabic. I had three hours every week of Arabic. I had the opportunity to have a lot of visits, met uh, activists, uh, uh, sent community center. I'm participating in women's rights program and I visited the some centers like uh, mental health um, center and also refugee camp and also women bazaar. We visited the two refugee camps uh, which are around Hebron, uh, so Fawar and uh, Aru. Uh, and we did various visits elsewhere. Um, one of the most interesting for me was Musafariyata, uh, which a small group of us went to to see uh, with uh, some people who were working there. For many, many months, um, I have been reading about Israel and Palestine, and I've had many questions. And as a result of not being able in America to find the answers to those questions, I wanted to come where I could speak to people directly and to find out for myself um, what I thought about um, what the situation was like here and how I could directly speak to people. Uh, I came here all by myself and this is my first trip to Hebron and I think uh, Hebron was very safe. With the program we did several visits. We visited the old city in Hebron which has a unique situation, very difficult to see, but very interesting, very important to understand. Uh, we had classes about the situation in Palestine, the history of it and the reasons for it and the status of Palestinian people. I chose to come here in Palestine because my master thesis was about the Israeli occupation and about post-Zionism. So I decided to come here to see with my eyes how the situation and the occupation here is here in Hebron. <laughs> 